30 something years ago or something is um, we we we, we were told, like he said, you, you're going to have a flying sausage on your car. And um, so, so when we turned up at the start of a rally and everyone saw our car, then you can imagine we were the joke of a day. But, um, but by the end of it, so, so Yuha was leading and crashed and we ended up first and um, managed to stay on first. Then, um, then the, the boot was on the other foot. So actually we got to laugh at everyone that, um, that we might have a funniest car, but we'd kicked everyone's butt as it was. So, um, but then all the... <laughs> so in a modest way we are supporting Ian and Jasper and we are delighted to do so we really are it brings excitement to me after 30 years having had such fun during the 1994 WRC hopefully uh, and really over to you please give us a lot of fun this rally Ian has done miracles in cars and I don't know how many of you know much about cars but he drove a Rover in the last classic rally now a rover in the mud but there was only a little bit of mud if i remember correctly but down at tighter way and the rest was dry and he was actually second on the last morning but when i spoke to him because we kept in touch he said i've lost a lot of power because the car is overheating and we can only do 200 kilometers an hour and i thought right He's lost power, car overheating, doing 200 kilometers an hour in a 35-year-old car. That's not bad, is it? But sure enough, they continued to lose power, and I believe a Porsche overtook him on the last morning, and you came third. <laughs>